All right, so today I'm going to try to use element queries to make the border color of an input element uh, kind of change color based on the number of characters that you've got inside of it. So to do that, we're going to need an input element. Let's style that. Let's give it a nice visible border. That's better. And now for the element queries. Let's make sure we've got that JavaScript added. Now we can do element input. Uh, the this inside the element query is going to refer to any input on our page. We want to change border color. So Let's use HSL. That gives us a number, saturation value in percent, and lightness value in percent. So if that's 50, we should see that change color when the page updates. So that's not animated. That's just with the element query. Let's go ahead and get that outline off. That's better than an outline, I think. OK. So instead of this number, let's animate uh, the input's value length um, by 10. So this value is uh, 0 to 360 for the hue. And then uh, that's the h here. So we're going to start with uh, 0 times 10 is 0. When you add uh, one character here, it's going to animate a little bit. Let me update the page. So now it's going to add 10 to the H every time we add something. And it goes all the way through and wraps right around. So that's one way you can use element queries.